Sasha and Wheelie were finished tidying around the flower beds and were ready for another job. Okay, team. Today, old Mr. Brown needs us to tidy around the trees on the Grand Lawn. Larry and his friends arrived at the trees and got straight to work. Rosie raked the leaves. Then Flash carried them to Wheelie. Tangles watered the flowers. And Larry mowed the lawn. But just as Wheelie trundled off, something hit him on the head. Ouch! cried Wheelie. What was that? Wheelie, are you okay? Oh, oh, I think so, Larry. Something hit me on the head. While Larry was trying to figure out what had happened to Wheelie, there was another thud. Ouch! cried Flash. What was that? Flash, are you okay? Yowie! I think so, Larry. Something hit me on the head. I wonder who could be doing this. While Larry was trying to figure out what had happened to Wheelie and Flash, there was another thud. Ouch! Ouch! cried Tangles. What was that? Tangles, are you okay? asked Larry. Ooh, I think so, Larry. Something hit me on the head. I wonder who could be doing this. Maybe it was Gnome, suggested Flash. But as usual, Gnome just smiled and didn't say a word. Ooh, that Gnome! In all that commotion, Rosie was trying to figure out what was going on, when another red, round object fell and hit her on the head. Ouch! said Rosie, who was looking around to see where all these red things were coming from. Rosie looked up and figured out exactly what was happening. She turned to the others and giggled with glee. <laughs> it's not known. Everybody look up! They all looked up in the air and saw lots of red round objects hanging from the branches of the tree. round and red and grows on a tree, said Rosie. Lots and lots of rocks. Rocks don't grow on trees. They must be bananas. But bananas are yellow. These must be potatoes. Potatoes grow in the ground, said Larry. Apples are round and red and grow on trees. Larry was right. They were standing under some apple trees that were filled with lots of juicy red apples. Sorry I thought it was you, Gnome. But as usual, Gnome just smiled and didn't say a word. Larry and his friends had finished tidying up around the apple tree, but all the falling apples had made another big mess. Oh no, what are we going to do? said Wheelie, as another apple fell. We'll have to pick them all 